Gamit ko to siya before going to bed. And... <laughs> Mare! Hey, you all! It's you girl! The internet house! And for today's vlog, mga girls, we're gonna be doing my perfume collection, pero this time, affordable edition naman. Kasi dun sa previous my perfume collection, that was my bougie collection. Like, super mahal. Medyo nakakalulo yung mga presyo, pero I swear, if you guys haven't watched my previous my perfume collection, you can check that one out if you wanna buy more high-end perfumes. You know, treat yourself in general, diba? Pero for this vlog naman, mga girls, we're gonna be doing a more affordable version pagdating sa perfume. Para amoy tayo masikap, sweet lang, fresh. Ganon, hindi magasto sa bulsa ganon. And also, mga girls, in this vlog, I have some mist, colognes, mga perfumes, and I even have here options for male. Kaya naman, mga girls, we have to also not forget our jaw bells, de ba? Charot. And of course, mga girls, in case you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe down below. Hit that bell notification icon so you're always notified. And lastly, mga girls, I'll be leaving all my social media links over here. So without further ado, mga girls, let's get started. Alright, mall girls, I have all the perfumes in front of me here. I have from Zara, Bench, I have here some Avon, Johnson's Baby Cologne. Yes, I do use Johnson's Baby Cologne actually. Bath and Body Works, I have Oxygen. And then, mall girls, actually, mas marami pa to eh. Pero I was thinking of doing the best and worst sana. Pero, yung mga worst, medyo marami na din. Yung mga hindi ko nagustuhan. So, sabi ko, I'll just feature the best na lang para hindi sayang yung oras. And maybe the video is gonna be super long. But, may mga ilan ilan dito sa perfume selection. To, that I don't like. So make sure you watch till the end of the video so you know what that is. We're gonna start Muna. Hmm. Okay, let's start Muna with perfumes Muna. So I'm gonna start first with Bench. So for the first perfume I have here, this is Beautiful Soul by Bea Alonso. And then you know, girls, when it comes to perfumes on Bench, in fairness, ha? actually, my girls, okay, sila. And I was like, why did no one tell me that Bench has good perfumes? Pero ang ayo ko lang sa Bench, ito lang. Just a warning, if you're gonna buy their perfumes, yung mga ganito, nasa bottle na to, when you initially spray it, literally, it smells like alcohol. You have to wait for the alcohol to dissipate. Dissipitate? Dissipitate. Oh my God. Mag fade away. Kasi alcohol talaga siya. Pag nawala yung alcohol smell, that's the time you can smell the fragrance. So this one, Beautiful Soul, for me, it just smells sweet, clean. Hindi siya nakaka-offend. Which, alam niyo mga curls, I also noticed what I like about really affordable perfumes or perfumes sa pang masa. Since hindi sila pwede maging complex when it comes to scents, unlike sa mga designer perfumes na medyo may mga tonka bean, mga leather, yung mga patchouli, yung mga ganun, para medyo sosyal-sosyali ng mga notes. Ang pansin ko lang sa mga affordable and drugstore perfumes, very basic sila. So, parang, if you have the type of nose na hindi ka mahilig sa perfumes, usually go for more affordable perfumes. Kasi usually, pagdating sa more high-end perfumes, they're very slightly pretentious na rin. Na parang, you have to be in the know to like that scent. May mga times na appreciate ko yung mga affordable perfumes. So, this is Beautiful Soul. Beautiful Soul smells very sweet. I actually really like this one. It gives me very clean vibe. Hindi siya super kalat yung amoy. It's very skin-like. You can only smell this pag malapit yung tao sa'yo. So, if you're into that scent, go for this one. Okay siya yung kay Bea Alonso. So, beautiful soul. Bitch, she's a beautiful soul. I'm not sure kung magkano ko siya binili, pero I'll just put the description of the price here. So, ayun. I really enjoyed this one actually. So, I was like, ah! Bench has good perfume. So, oh my gosh. Then, the next one I have from Bench pagdating sa perfume, this is Love Affair ni Lovie Paul. This one smells super sweet, pero seductive siya. Like, alam mo yun? Ayan na naman siya, girl. Abi alcohol siya, dai. Pero yon. And also, pagdating sa longevity ng bench, hindi siya super duper long lasting. I mean, obviously, kasi mura naman siya. Pero for me, the best indicator that if a perfume is not long lasting, pag you initially spray the perfume, amoy alcohol siya agad, yon. That's like an indicator to me na, ah, I feel ko hindi to long lasting. So this is Love Affair ni Lovey Po. This is an Eau de Toilette. This one, it smells very soapy. Alam niyo, if you like, the smell of like shampoo, yung mabangong shampoo. Like, oh my god, like, comment down below. Don't you have those times pag bagong ligo ka, tapos yung amoy ng shampoo, sobrang bango. Like, parang ang linis-linis mo, ang bango, parang bagong ligo amoy. This is the perfume for you. Like, amoy bagong ligo ka, curl. Tapos what I like about this, ito, medyo makalat siya. And for some reason, comparing to the other bench na perfumes that I have here, this lasts longer. I ko, maybe it's my chemistry, my body, my pheromones, or whatever. Pero mas long-lasting to compared dun sa beautiful soul ni Bea Alonso. 
So this one, Lovey Po. Girl, at saka alam niyo, binili ko to kasi idol ko talaga si Lovey Po. So, <laughs> so medyo biased ako dahi. Pero no, pero swear, comparing this kay Beautiful Soul, I like this better than Beautiful Soul. Yeah, mas clean yung amoy and even the age range, mas younger yung smell niya compared kay Beautiful Soul. Then the next perfume I have here, this is Bench Eau de Toilette. This is Impalpable Dreams by Michael Cinco. This packaging, alam nyo, una kita ko pala dito, sabi ko, wow, Versace Eros, ikaw ba yan, guy? Nakakaloka. At saka parang siyang ano, Tom Ford ni Rolly yung packaging, yung ganitong color. For me, this one smells very unisex. Pero more leaning towards male. But it's not musky. It's very citrusy, very fruity, and very sweet. Ang linis nga na amoy niya eh. I actually really like this. It smells very unisex. If you're a girl, I can see you wear this. And if you're a guy, I can also see you wear this. It smells very clean. It just, for me lang ha, I don't know if I could smell it, but it has a slight hint of leather, but in a sexy kind. So it smells fruity, citrusy, and leathery. Very slight lang. Pero ang linis ng amoy nito. I really enjoyed this one. And in terms of longevity naman, these two perfumes, ito ay Palpable Dreams, tsaka yung kay Lovey Po, they last long ha, in fairness. Yung kay Bea nga, so, I don't know about you, girl, but why are you not lasting long? At saka mga girls, pagdating sa impalpable dreams ng Ben, unang spray, hindi siya amoy alcohol, in fairness. Like, pagka-spray mo, yun yung scent agad. Like, hindi siya amoy alcohol. I enjoy this one. Alright, mga girls, so those are perfumes ng Ben. For me, pagdating sa rating ng Ben perfumes from 1 to 10, I would give them an 8. Kasi affordable sila. Some doesn't last long, but some does. If you're the type of person who doesn't want to blind buy perfumes, Bench Perfumes is a safe bet. Except yung mga iba sa Michael Cinco, medyo pretentious yung amoy niyan. Pero for this one, if you want a safe blind buy, Impopable Dreams is a good choice. Kasi yung ibang Michael Cinco medyo weird yung amoy. So these are the perfumes that I like sa Bench. Alright, mga girls. So let's move on naman sa Bench colognes that I would recommend. Alam niyo mga girls, I'm pretty sure ang dami sa inyo mag-expect yung mga so in love. Oh my God. Yun yung mga parang sobrang, sobrang popular niya. Like, oh my god. Ano ba yung mga sikat sa bench? Comment down below. Pero alam niyo mga girls, to be honest, oh my god. I feel like you're gonna crucify me. Pagdating sa bench so in love, hindi ko actually siya bet. Like, comment down below. Ako lang ba? I feel like I'm not the only one who doesn't like so in love. Parang medyo naaasiman pa nga ako dun eh. So, pagdating sa bench colognes, alam niyo mga girls, nagulat ako sa presyo nito kasi it's so affordable. If I'm not mistaken, yung parang cologne nila nasa 159? Basta 100 something lang. Super duper mura yung cologne ng bench and I'm like why did I not check this out before I'm like what so pagdating sa cologne I love Main Mendoza's cologne this one in particular the blue one itong uh, main girl my god ang bango neto even my brother inamoy ito ng kuya ko sabi niya ang bango it smells so sweet parang amoy candy alam mo yun like amoy flirty na candy so I swear if you're a high schooler or if you're on a budget and you want to smell sweet like candy I I enjoy this even my brother super gusto gusto ito ng kuya ko kasi naalala niya yung ex niya. At parang ganito daw yung amoy niya. So I was like, Alay ka ba? Like ito, amoy candy yung jowa mo. So I really like this one. It smells so sweet. I wouldn't say fresh and clean. Sweet. Just sweet lang talaga. Very pabebe talaga. Then next I have here, this is Main Love. Ito, bet ko talaga to. At saka alam niyo mga kras, pansin ko din, itong Main Mendoza na cologne, yung body spray nila. Hindi siya may alcohol. Unlike yun nga, I find it so weird. Yung sa bench, yung love affair and beautiful soul. Pag unang spray, amoy alcohol. I'm like, huh? That's weird. That's suspicious. And then in terms of like the body spray, they do also last a long time, which is so weird and it blows my mind. Especially the blue one. Mas long lasting yung blue. So ito main love, yung red one. They also have a yellow one. That one does not smell good. Ang asim ng amoy nun. No, it's not it. This one, medyo matamis siya, pero mas toned down siya. Ito mas super tamis na ito. That's why I kind of like this because it's so girly. Ito parang ano ka, you're a sweet girl, very girly. Pero yung tipo, first honor ka, yung gano'n. Ito yung parang ano ka, girly pero maharot. Yung parang gusto mo lagi man trip sa school, gano'n. Pero ito yung parang ano ka, overachiever, pero sweet ka, gano'n. Like, this gives me like very... Very smart girl vibes, first honor, you get on. Medyo marami rami sinalihan na curriculum activities, you get on. So, this one is more subdued compared to this. This is super sweet. Like, talagang pak na pak talaga yung paka sweet net. Pero for me, in terms ko nyari, medyo sensitive yung ilong mo kung nakahilo ba siya. For me, hindi. I don't know if they call it offensive. Yun ba yun? Yung parang, is it offensive yung scent? Like, comment down below, yun ba yun? Yung parang, pag tinatawag na offensive, yung parang, pag inamoy mo, parang, ang tapang naman ito. Yun ba yung offensive? Correct me if I'm wrong, hindi ko alam yung mga terminology. Pero I'm learning yung mga sillage, di ba? Yung mga longevity, projection, ganon. Projection-wise, these body sprays, 
they're not just skin scents. Kay Maine Mendoza, ang lakas mag-project. I have no idea why. Ang lakas niya mag-project for a cologne. I'm like, talaga? In fairness. Like, ngayon pa nga lang, naamoy ko na siya eh. Dito pa lang, oh. Ito yung red and then the blue. I can smell it from here right now. Na nasa kamay ko lang siya. Alright, Malka. So, moving on to the next body spray. I have here, they have like Brat Splash. One is Cranberry Jam Cologne. And then, this one is the Cherry Bomb. This one, yung Cranberry Jam. Wait lang, spray ko na siya sa ano? Sa tela. Ito yung Cranberry Jam. Did I have it to one time. Para sabi ng kuya ko, uh, you smell like medicine. And I'm like, what? So you actually, I liked it at first because it smells like strawberry to me. Pero sabi ng kuya ko, amoy cough syrup. And I'm like, bitch, at first I liked it, pero ngayon ayoko na. Kasi, dai, amoy cough syrup daw, dai. So ayun, I just don't like it anymore. So, cranberry jam, it's not a jam. It's a jam mug. Char! <laughs> Anyway, so moving on. So next we have here Cherry Bomb. Ito naman. Actually, balik tad ngayon. When I first got this, I like Cranberry Jam. Cherry Bomb yung ayoko naman. Pero now, I ended up not liking both of this. Kasi, ito naman, para amoy gamot naman to sa akin. So I was like, girl, alam mo yung Brat Splash nila yung Cranberry Jam and Cherry Bomb. Pass na lang kayo kasi amoy gamot daw talaga, girl. Cherry Bomb to me smells like medicine. Tapos yung Cranberry Jam, sabi ng kuya ko, amoy cough syrup. Which I'm like... Bitch, I initially liked this, but now the serious self-esteem ko dito. So ayon. And also, mga cross chica ko lang din. That time, suot ko to. I was literally outside. Parang nasa mawa kami yung seaside. Dai, oh my god. This is amoy ko, amoy cough syrup. Shit. Nakakaya, girls. So ayon. So for the last body spray ng bench, I have here. This is bench. I'm stuck on you. Para sa cactus. Which for me, alam nyo, I like this. This is so nice. To me, it doesn't smell like cactus. Or if there's a scent ng cactus, that's interesting. This one smells like watermelon. Hindi ko alam kung bakit cactus yung picture niya, pero it smells like watermelon. Alam mo yung mga watermelon na skincare, yung mga Glow Recipe watermelon, BLK watermelon, yung mga ganun. Puro basta it smells like exactly like watermelon. So if you want to smell like watermelon or you want to smell clean kahit mainit yung weather, okay na okay to. I really love this one. Tinan mo, medyo nabawasan na nga siya kasi I keep using this all the time pag lalabas ako and if I have to run errands tas medyo mainit. I love this one. Ang linis ang amoy niya. Basta, amoy watermelon siya. Like, malinis na watermelon na sweet. I think this is a different variant. Hindi siya yung Brat Splash. This is a different one. Meron silang ibang variants neto but this is the best. Yung others, ang baho. Pero ito, ang baho. Amoy watermelon talaga to. Which I don't know why. Bakit cactus in picture. Bakla, may amoy ba yung cactus? Nakakalokas. Para nasa 150 pesos lang ata ito eh. But this, get this one. I'm stuck on you. Oh my God! Para ka tali Ariane. I'm stuck on you! Stuck on you! Stuck me! Oh my god, I feel like I love this because it's almost like Ariana Grande single. Shut up! Highly recommend this. Like, alam ni Marcos, kahit puntahan niyo yung store, tas mag amoy kayo ng tester, mare. Ang bow na ito, swear. Alright, Marcos, so moving on, let's still do colognes. I have here a couple of colognes over here. Alam ni Marcos, ito na viral pa nga ito sa TikTok. Kaya napabili ako na ito, nakakaloka. So, I wanna start off first. Ang dami kasi sa inyo na recommend ng body fantasy. Super mura lang na ito. This is like literally 199 pesos. My favorites are cucumber watermelon. My God, ang linis na amoy nito. It smells very fresh, very light. Kung hindi ka mahilig sa fragrance, kung ayaw mo magperfume, if you want something light or if you want something that will work sa weather, my God, this is such a clean scent. Itong cucumber melon. It smells like melon. I don't smell cucumber. Maybe kasi yung freshness lang yun yung cucumber note. Ang ganda nito. And I also like the spray. Ano kasi ang spray niya? De ba? Ah, oh my god, Alinis, I swear. I love this one. This is my favorite variant. This is the Cucumber Melon Body Fantasies. Super mura na ito. Tapos, you get 94 ml. I really like this one. Tapos, if you like sweet scents naman, this one, this is Body Fantasies, Sweet Pea Fantasy. Ang tamis, ang pabebe ng amoy na ito. This smells like candy. Literally like candy. Alam mo yung mga candy na parang XO na candy na parang strawberry flavor. This smells so sweet. I like this one. Sweet, pero hindi masakit sa ulo. Kasi may mga ibang sweet, let's say, Victor Roth na flower bomb. Pag napasobra ka ng spray, ang sakit nun sa ulo, girl. This one, eh, hindi siya ganun kasakit sa ulo. Ang linis na amoy na ito. What I like about body fantasies, very light yung amoy nila. Alam niyo mga curls, sa body fantasies, ang hindi ko bet yung white musk. I think I have it over there, pero hindi ko na sinali dito kasi what's the point? Hindi ko siya bet yung white musk ba yun? Amoy kulob. I don't like that smell. Amoy kulob siya for me. I like these two talaga. If you're into fresh scents, if you're into clean scents, I love this. Pagdating naman sa projection na ito, okay naman siya kasi ang lakas na niya mag-spray eh. Malakas yung spray niya. So, naturally, it'll spread around the room. Longevity wise, comparing both of them for some weird reason, 
mas long lasting sa akin si cucumber melon. Kaya ito talaga yung pinaka bet ko. I swear to God, this is so good. It's only for 199 pesos. So good. And also, mga girl, share ko lang din. Pagdating sa perfumes, I don't always use my perfumes. I have so much perfumes as you've seen sa previous my perfume collection vlog. Fair. Pero for the most part, mga girls, I always use colognes and mist kasi it's very forgiving. At saka pwede ka maligo ng cologne. Minsan nililiguan ko yung cologne kasi total hindi naman siya super duper long lasting. So, medyo malakas yung amoy ng cologne pero throughout the day, magpe-fade naman siya eh. So, that's a tip for y'all. If you're gonna be using your cologne, don't be shy, mga girls. Iligo nyo siya kasi magpe-fade lang naman siya eh. Ganyan yung technique ko, mga girls, pagdating sa mist, which I'll be talking about that later. So, moving on, mga girls, to colognes. I have here, this is my favorite cologne ever since I was high school. Syempre, there was a trend na uso yung juicy cologne, di ba? Like, you're the it girl no high school when you're using juicy cologne. Yung juicy cologne na red, yung juicy cologne na pink. Oh my God. If you're a juicy cologne user, you're one of the basic bitch. You think you're an it girl, but you are a basic bitch. Pero alam nyo, pagdating sa juicy cologne naman, if you use the red one, you're a bad bitch. Yeah. If you use the red juicy cologne, you're a certified bad bitch. For me, red, blue, and green, low-key though, if you're using those, you're a bad bitch. Pero yung pink, you're a basic bitch. All right, mga girls. So pagdating sa cologne, this has been my favorite cologne ever since I was high school. Like, kasi this smells something like in Burberry. This is Johnson's Baby Summer Swing. Specifically, the green one. I always use this. As you can see nga, super bawas na siya. Kasi, bisa pag nasa bahay ako, pag after ko maligo, nagkukulong lang ako. Hindi ako nagpa-perfume. Bakla, magsasaya ako ng pera, gumamit ng perfume. Eh, nandito lang naman ako sa bahay. Pero this is my favorite cologne. Super linis neto. It smells like something in Burberry. Nakalimutan ko. The reason why I mention Burberry whenever I always use the scent. Kasi, one time, my mom, nagbakasyon siya sa Dubai, which doon kami napakanak. So, bumalik lang siya sa Dubai. And that time, nasa Philippines kami. So, nagdala siya ng mga pasalubang and stuff and perfumes. So, she bought this one perfume na Burberry. Tapos, inamoy ko. Sabi ko, ang bango na ito. Tapos, yung isang classmate ko, gumamit siya ng cologne. Pakpakpak, naglagay siya ng cologne. Sabi ko, ano yung cologne mo? Ang bango. Ano yung pabango mo? Ang bango. Sabi niya, ito lang. Pinakita niya sa akin yung Johnson Summer Swing. Sabi ko, oh my God. Dala ko yung perfume na yun, yung Burberry. Kasi nasa sample lang siya. Yung nakalagay lang sa ano, sample card that you can just open and then you like, there's like a stick in there. Ganon. Inamoy ko, kinumpare ko. Bitch, identical siya sa Burberry. So, this one, this is my favorite cologne. It smells so clean, not super sweet, very mild. If you have a kid or if you just love colognes, if you don't, if you're not into perfumes, my god, this is so good. And comparing sa lahat ng colognes ng Johnson's Baby, this also lasts the longest. This is the best one. I don't care about the pink, I don't care about the blue, I don't care about the other Johnson's Baby cologne. Meron pa kasi lang cologne yung parang may feature na super long-lasting daw. Hindi nga siya masyadong long-lasting. But this, try nyo Summer Swing. Meron pa kasi lang super liit na size eh. Girl, I love this. I always use this pag nasa bahay ako. Like, as you can see, super bawas na siya. I don't use my perfumes. I just use cologne. I just use baby cologne. And also, when it comes to days that I have to be under the sun, I just use cologne. Kasi hindi naman siya super long-lasting. And it's very forgiving na mag-retouch ng cologne. Kasi minsan may mga tendencies na pag mag-retouch ka ng body spray or mist, medyo nagiging maasim na. Tsaka nagiging kadiring amoy. That's why I only use cologne. Kasi it's very forgiving pagdating, let's say, nahagard ka or parang nahanginan ka ng pollution dito sa Pinas. Diba? Nakakaloka the humidity of cologne, it's more forgiving. You just dust yourself off and then just put a little cologne. Instantly, it will smell fresh kasi total, hindi naman siya super long lasting so it doesn't mix with your sweat or pollution or the air around you. I highly recommend cologne. Lagi ka nagko-commute. Stay away from body mist for the most part. Cologne is forgiving. Okay siya. It may not be long lasting but in terms of like touching up your cologne throughout the day, it's forgiving. Alright, mga girls. So moving on to this cologne. Alam nyo, sobrang hirap na tong bilhin. This is the Avon K baby calming lavender cologne gentle and mild kasi sobrang nag-viral to sa TikTok out of nowhere and I was like what is up with this cologne so sobrang na-curious ako I was like bitch you know what mag-order ako tapos nang pumunta ako sa Shopee lahat sold out pumunta ako sa Lazada lahat sold out girl nakakaloka you know how I got this naghanap ako ng reseller ng Avon dito sa amin as in naghanap ako ng reseller mari like naghanap ako ng mga contacts best para mabili ko to alam nyo when it comes to this cologne you know what mga girls I totally get it alam nyo it's not the best. It's not groundbreaking. Nothing special about it. Pero I get it. I totally get it. Alam nyo, amoy baby siya na para ang sarap mong yakapin. Ito naman, ginagamit ko to siya before going to bed. And <laughs> Mare! Oh my God! Alam nyo, pag suot ko to, minsan magkasama ko yung 
<laughs> Pag suot ko to dahil, lagi ako niyayakap mare. At saka mga girls, what I like about this, sobrang linis ng amoy niya, tapos amoy baby, tapos parang for some weird reason, inaantok ako pag inaamoy ko to. After ko mag half bath before going to bed, I always wear this. Lagi ako inaantok. For me, it smells like powdery, lavender, and sweet. It smells like a baby cologne. I just love this. So good. Before we move on, mga curls, I have here, these are oxygen perfumes. I want to start first with the female perfumes. Pagdating sa female perfumes, I only like one sa oxygen. May, alam niyo, mga curls, may like DM sa akin neto. Sabi niya, try mo yung 11.55. This is a different packaging. Parang siya limited edition ng anime character. Comment down below kung sino tong anime character nito. I'm just not familiar. This one, 11.55. Ito yung women's. If you're into yung parang bagong ligo talaga, like soapy na amoy, na sobrang fresh go for this for me this one smells like soap like literally i don't know if you're into that smell but for some reason medyo gusto ko siya alam niyo minsan yung para mga ibang medyo weird siya alam niyo para dishwasher na soap na para ang bango pa rin no para pag naghuhugas ka ng pinggan that soapy smell but it smells good ito yon 11.55 it smells like bagong ligo oh you know what mga girls it smells like a bubble bath alam niyo yung mga bubble bath na nilalagay sa tub tapos you like lather it para magbubble yung tub it smells like that you want to smell like literally bagong ligo, bagong lugod, ganon. Ito yun. 11.55. In fairness, ang bangon niya. Moving on, mga girls, of course, we're not gonna forget our sweet boys. Pagdating sa fragrance that I would recommend for boys, I have here again from Oxygen kasi in fairness. Pagdating sa male fragrance, how the hell do you guys nail it? Like, oh my god. At saka mga girls, may mga times sa alam nyo na mahilig ako sa amoy jowa, diba? So, the first one I have here, this is from Oxygen. This is Skate 180. Alam nyo mga girls, ito amoy fuck boy to. Nakakaloka. Super liit niya. But oh my god. It smells musky. Parang may pagka-marine. And it smells very fresh. Mare, ito. Skate 180. Mm-mm. Mapapa 180 ka talaga, girl. Alright, so the next fragrance I have here, this is 11.55 naman ng Oxygen Men. Kasi may women. Ito yung women. This is 11.55 from men. Alam niyo mga curls, this one, it's almost like a dupe ng Gucci Guilty. Ito, 11.55. Pag inaamoy ko yung Gucci Guilty and this one, it smells literally the same. It reminds me of a basketball player who's a varsity, na scholar, matalino, pero medyo fuckboy. Ganon. Ganon siya. Gives me that vibes. Naalala ko talaga yung Gucci Guilty na green. Medyo musky, super masculine. Very sporting amoy. Not citrusy. It just smells like an alpha male. You know what I mean? It smells like a chad. You know what I mean? So, 11.55. Okay, ito. Skate 180 and 11.55. If you're a boy on a budget and you want to smell good, ito maganda. And also, can I just say, pagdating sa projection and longevity ng oxygen, super lakas niya. Like, especially the male perfumes, you just need two spritz and you're fine. Kasi if you spritz a lot, pansin ko, sumasakit ulo ko. Like, ganun siya kalakas. So, just two spritz, you're fine. You don't need a lot of this, okay? So, moving on, we have here, these are perfumes sa Oxygen. I have here, this is Oomo. What's a Oomo? This is Oxygen's Uwomo. This one, hindi ko masyado bet. Ang sakit lang neto sa ulo. It smells like an old dude. You know what I mean? Like an old dude that smokes cigars. He's always under the sun. Yeah, medyo nakakahilo yung amoy neto. I don't like this. It's too much. So, Uwomo, it's at oh no, bitch. Ito, hindi ko lang to bet. Alright, so the next fragrance we have here, this is Pitch Black from Oxygen. It's an Eau de Toilette. Alam nyo, ito din, hindi ko din to bet. This one smells like cigar. Like an old man that loves smoke cigar or tobacco. This one naman, it smells like an old man na mahilig mag-alak. You know when you smell alcohol on someone? Kunyari, bagong inom, naglaklak siya na al alcohol or galing siya sa bar. And then you can smell the alcohol sa damit nila. Ito yun. Parang ang sakit sa ulo, ang asim. Kaya nga ako nag-perfume, di ba? Para amoy fresh, amoy yummy. Pero ito dahi, parang amoy pa-uwi ka na dahi. Hindi ka amoy papunta sa bar. Parang amoy ka pa-uwi sa bar dahi. So, pagdating sa male perfumes ng Oxygen, get Skate 180. My God, ang bango na ito. And also, 11.55. Between these two, I really love Skate 180. Trust me, itong dalawa, ang lakas mga pogi points. Like, if you're on a budget, okay ito. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on to more affordable fragrances 
because this is from Zara. Alam niyo mga girls, technically Zara hindi siya super duper affordable. Hindi ba 900 pesos siya, but 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 wag niyo smallin. You can actually buy sample size. Nasa 300 pesos ata yung sample size nila eh, which I actually have two of this ng fam, which I'll be explaining why. And also mga girls, if you're gonna be buying full sizes ng Zara, you amoy niyo amoy designer. And how much is a designer perfume? Nasa magkano? 7,000? 8,000? 5,000? 10,000 pa nga eh. Pero yung Zara, makuha mo lang siya na 900 pesos. Amoy designer na siya. Which these ones, may dupe siya actually. And I really love the smell. Alright mga girls, so starting off for the first fragrance, this is Zara Apple Juice. Alam niyo mga girls, I smelled it side by side with Chanel Chance, yung O Tender, the pink one. Bakla, parehas na parehas, as in, like, Amoy malinis, amoy fresh, clean ng amoy niya. They smell really similar. It's exactly the same. Oh my god. This is Chanel Chance U Tender and then this is Apple Juice. Parehas na parehas. And it smells like you're a pretty girl. And you're not just pretty. You're like really kind. You're kind, popular, and pretty. You smell like that. But in terms of longevity, mas long lasting, of course, is Chanel compared to Zara. Mas grabi yung projection neto. Like if mag two sprays lang ako kalat na kalat siya sa room. This one. Kalat na kalat din siya, pero hindi siya super duper long lasting. But it smells exactly like Chanel Eau Tender. I really love this perfume. This has been my perfume ng February, March, ito. Ang linis ng amoy niya, amoy girly. Tas you smell rich, classy, popular, and you're pretty. And not just pretty, but you're also kind. Yun. I swear, ito, amoy mayaman siya. The next mga curls I have here, this is Zara Twilight Mauve. My God! This smells like green tea. Sobrang linis ng amoy neto. Sobrang fresh neto. Alam nyo, if you can't afford for Zara Twilight Mauve. This one, the closest scent na you can buy, na mas mura dito, I would suggest Green Tea by Miniso. Yon, Okay yon. It's not exactly the same, pero very similar. Very light, clean, fresh. Hindi siya mabigat sa ilong. Slightly fruity, pero mas light yung si Miniso Green Tea. Pero oh my god, ito Twilight Mauve. Try nyo to. Ang bango. Actually, may nag-DM din sa akin na ito. Try mo Twilight Mauve. This, my god. It's so freaking good. Gonna pa order ako nito eh. Then next I have here, this is Zara's Pink Flambe. Ito shocks. Ang bao nito. Like alam niyo mga girls, I swear. Pagkasama ko jawa ko lagi. It's either Zara Pink Flambe or Fen. Which I have Pink Flambe here. I only got sample size because I'm shopping at the mall. So nagbili ako ng mga sample sizes like itong Fen. Bumili ako ng Fen. Chaka Pink Flambe. Kasi girl, like shopping ako na perfume, ang bigat bigat, puro bote. This one smells really sweet, very candy, very girly. I love it. And pagdating sa Zara perfume, they do last long. Pero not super long na parang sabihin natin, Chanel, na buong araw, yung ganon. Sakto lang, parang maybe 1 to 3 hours, ganon. Okay naman siya. Pero pag yung kasama mo lalapit sa iyo, tapos aamuyin ka, maamuyin pa naman sa damit. It's so moving on to my favorite scent sa Zara. My God, this is my favorite scent. Alam nyo, initially, bumili lang ako ng sample neto. This is Zara Femme. I only bought a sample size kasi number one para on a budget 300 pesos and then number two ayoko masyadong magbitbit kasi may mga bitbit akong shopping bags that day so syempre alam ko nung bibitbitin ko to lahat diba ang bigat bigat so inamoy ko siya girl my god amoy vanilla alam mo yung parang amoy vanilla cupcake na ang yummy Swear, ang yummy-yummy mo, Dan. And yun, bumili mo lang ako ng sample size. Bakla, napa-order tuloy ako ng full size kasi I just love the smell of this. It smells like vanilla cupcake. Like vanilla cupcake mixed with sex. So good. When I swear, try nyo tong fem. Sobrang maharot tong amoy neto, pero hindi siya offensive. Then this one lasts long. For some reason, I spray this on myself. I can still smell it the next day sa damit ko. Like, comment down below. Ako lang ba? Out of all the Zara perfumes, the one that lasts long to me, itong Twilight Mauve, grabe to. To the point na you don't have to wear a lot of this. Kasi there's this one time na itong Twilight Mauve, niligo ko siya, girl. Tapos parang bumaho siya sa sobrang dami. Kaya you don't need a lot of this. Two sprays lang, you're fine. Itong fem naman, medyo forgiving siya if you spray it all over your body, but it lasts long, in fairness. Even the next day, I can still smell it sa damit ko. Like, ako lang ba? Like, comment down below if you have tried Zara Femme. It's so good. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on to the final brand we have here, Bath and Body Works. This is like the epitome sa mga on a budget dyan na gusto ng bonggang perfumes. Ito na yung curl. So, I always want to start off with my favorite. Actually, mga curls, na feature ko na to dun sa previous perfume collections. This is Bath and Body Works Gingham. This has been my first fragrance with Bath 
Bath and Body Works. Because a friend recommended this to me. Because she said it's the Heart Evangelista, and it smells so clean. Like, so sweet na amoy niya, ang linis na amoy niya. Like, kung pawisin ka, I swear, I would recommend this. This is good for mainit na weather. This is good for malamig na weather. It just smells so clean. Tsaka, alam niyo mga girls, pagdating sa bath and body na mist, Sobra forgiving niya. Ay, comment down below. Ako lang ba? How I use Bath and Body Works? Bakla pinapaliguan ko to. So, am I the only one? And that goes on for like one minute. Like, it's so forgiving. Like, okay, sige, napaliguan ko siya. Like, amoy na amoy na yung perfume sa katawan ko. Pero hindi naman siya super duper long lasting. At saka hindi rin siya amoy pungent. Like, kahit napasobran ka pa maglagay. Parang, amoy normal lang siya. And then it lasts throughout the day. Like, as in long lasting siya since napaliguan mo naman siya. Right? So, I really, really enjoy Bath and Body Works. Kasi kahit i-douse mo yung katawan mo, paliguan mo yung perfume sa'yo, hindi siya umaasim, hindi siya nagbabago yung scent. It still stays the same. It just fades. But the way it fades, it makes it seem like your perfume lasts so long. Like, ako lang ba? That's why I really have a pleasant experience pagdating sa Bath and Body Works. And also, mga girls, if you're gonna buy Bath and Body Works, advice ko, buy online. Kasi mas mura. Kasi minsan pagtitingin ka sa mall or somewhere, parang nasa 800. Pero usually online, I always buy Bath and Body Works nasa 500, 400. Minsan nga, pag naka-sale yung store, around 350. Nakakuha ko pa siya ng ganun price. I better shut up. So, ayan nga, mga girls. Pagdating sa Gingham, this has been my first Bath and Body Works perfume. I really love this super bango neto. Ang linis, ang fresh, ang tamis. Basta, this is like the perfect ratio. If you're not into fragrances, if mahilig ka mo fragrances, you will love this talaga. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on, mga girls. We have here, this is In The Stars ng Bath & Body Works. Alam niyo, mga girls, ang dami nag-recommend na parang this is like a dupe ng Baccarat 540. Also, mga girls, natawa ako dun sa previous My Perfume Collection. Sabi daw nila, fake daw yung Baccarat Rouge ko. Parang galing daw sa bangketa. Mare, may COVID. Sa tingin mo, makakapunta ako ng bangketa, first of all. And also, tip ko lang din, if you wanna buy a perfume na if it's original, tingnan nyo yung tube niya. Pag nagde-disappear siya sa liquid, like, if you see the tube dito sa surface na walang perfume, tas nagiging invisible yung ano niya, yung tube niya, that's when you know it's original. I don't know if you guys can see it, pero ayan, parang andyan yung tube niya sa taas, pero nagiging invisible siya sa liquid. That's when you know it's original. So this, mari naman, hindi naman ako bibili ng fake na, kung bibili lang naman ako baka ratlush, dahi, original na lang tayo, dahi. So this one, this is in the stars. If you want something that's similar, Similar na Baccarat Rouge 540. This is so good. Alam nyo, ito, Baccarat Rouge, I got so much compliments neto. Like, if you've seen my previous vlog dun sa my perfume collection, ang dami na compliments sa akin. I swear, this is a compliment getter. It smells like amber, saffron, very slightly warm. I love it. Smells clean. This one, in the stars, it smells very similar. Super similar. Parang very saffron, amber. It smells very warm. It smells slightly toasty. Parang dun sa Baccarat Rouge. Pero, hindi siya super duper long lasting. Yung sa Baccarat Rouge Girl. Kahit maglalaba na ako ng damit, magsasegregate ako ng white damit and colored na damit na aamoy ko pa rin siya sa labada, girl. So, it's expensive but it's really worth it. But if you want something that's very similar ng Baccarat Rouge, go for In The Stars. Ang dami nag-request nga sa akin na I should try this kasi it reminds them of Baccarat Rouge, which I agree. For me, not exactly similar, but it gets the vibes. Yung warm na amber na medyo clean na fresh na smell. It smells just like that. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on to the next perfume ng Bath & Body Works. This one is my personal favorite. Super gusto gusto ko talaga to. This is in the scent You're the One. Alam niyo, mga girls, I just recently discovered, bago lang pala to, yung You're the One. Grabe! Alam niyo, mga girls, pag sinasabi natin, like, oh my god, amoy baby boy siya. Amoy, ang bango niya. Parang, di ba, we always say boys, like, they smell clean, they smell fresh, like, they smell yummy, yung ganon. This is like the girl version of it. Don't you have those times sa pag binigyan ka ng panyo ng guy, and then, like, the scent ng guy is in that hanky and it smells so good. This is like the girl version of it. If you want to smell like yung parang galamang hokage, yung tipong low-key pero high-key moves, ganon. This is so good. You smell so clean, so fresh, so girly, and it medyo may amoy siyang strawberry tapos sober long-lasting neto. This is a new variant ng Bath & Body. It's so long-lasting. I don't know why comparing to the other BBW na mist na I have to, kailangan ko paliguan to. Ito parang kung pinaliguan ko to, girl, hanggang bukas na yung amoy. I don't know why, pero why can't all the BBW miss be like this? Mag perform. Sobrang bonet. Like, whenever I wear this one, I got so much compliments. In the dentist office, a mall, pet store, nagpota kami ng vet. Para na amoy nila to. 
I swear, you're the one, bitch, you're the one talaga, like, girl, she's the one. Pero alam niyo mga girls, sa sobrang nagustuhan ko tong scent na to, bumili ako ng lotion version, hindi ko na bit. I swear, yung lotion version, hindi siya mabango. Amoy weird. Sabi ko, bakit ganun? Iba yung amoy na lotion sa perfume. Pero if you're planning to get you're the one, get the mist. Ang bango. The lotion, no, skip that. Alright mga girls, so for the next set we have here, this is Champagne Problems. Shout out. Ano, Taylor Swift na naman, girl. This is Champagne Toast ng Bath and Body Works. This one has Prosecco, uh, Bubble Champagne, and Juicy Tangerine. Ito amoy fruity. Fruity and clean. I love this. If you're into fruity scents, you will love this talaga. It smells like yung mga Capri Sun na juice. Ganon. Pero less juicy. More like it smells like fragrance, not like beverage. Yung ganon. Para it smells like a juice to me. Parang sobrang citrusy na fruity niya na ang yummy ng amoy niya. Pero napakalinis ng amoy mo. Ito, champagne toast. If you're not into fragrance, you will love this. Kung medyo mabilis ka mahilo sa fragrance, ito, ang ganda na ito. Champagne toast. I love it. So next, moving on, this one's a thousand wishes. Medyo may pagka-champagne toast to. Pero ito, comparing kay champagne toast, si champagne toast smells like a juice, pero more fragrance, less beverage. This one smells slightly soapy. For me, it smells sweet, girly, tapos medyo soapy siya. Less parang beverage-y, parang ganon. It smells so good. This one's a thousand wishes. Between champagne toast and thousand wishes, I've been wearing this most of the time compared to champagne toast. Alright, mga girls. So for the next scent we have here, this is Bath & Body Works Fresh Gardenia. If you're a huge fan ng Crystal Gardenia ni Kim Kardashian, or if you're a huge fan ng Chanel Eau Tender, pero medyo parang nalalakasan ka sa amoy nila, this is like a very milder version niya. Like, amoy virgin talaga. Like, amoy Mama Mary. Amoy Sampagita, pero amoy May, may halong sweetness. Like, it smells so clean and so fresh and so virginal. I swear. If I'm wearing a white outfit, ito lagi yung perfume kasi it just fits with the vibe. Basta amoy virgin talaga. For me, mga curls, Fresh Gardenia reminds me of Clinique Happy in Bloom. Pero si In Bloom, medyo mas powdery. Uh -uh, mas powdery siya compared to this. This is more like straightforward yung amoy neto. Mas may lakas to compared dun sa Clinique. Pero ang lakas neto maka amoy virgin. I swear. Alright, so moving on to the next two scents here. Ito may Medyo popular to. This is Into the Night. Ang dami nag-hype na ito. Pero alam niyo mga girls, it smells so boring. Parang wala. Wala. As in. Parang it's trying so hard na maging you're the one. Pero wala. Ang boring talaga. Like, and it doesn't last long. So, I don't know why. Ang dami nagsasabi na long-lasting to. Pero alam niyo, if you want something long-lasting na ganito din yung vibe, go for you're the one. Napaka long-lasting na ito. I swear. This one, hindi. It's, and it's also so boring. I promise. Like, don't waste your money on this. But I'm pretty sure there's some people out there na gusto gusto nila to. Don't take offense. This is just my personal preference. Pero ito, hindi ko masyado bet. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on, we have here. This is BBW Toasted Praline Pear. Alam niyo, mga girls, binili ko to kahit medyo nakakaduda na yung color, mare. Para medyo questionable yung color, eh. Binili ko to, girl. Tapos, do inamoy ko bakla. Amoy, alam niyo yung fudgy bar na green? Girl, it smells like fudgy bar na green. Hindi ko alam kung matutuwa ako sa amoy neto. Oh, magugutom ako, girl eh. Bakla amoy merienda. Fudgy bar na green. Pandan. I am not lying. It smells like pandan. Parang pag isaspray mo to sa room, parang sino nagbe-bake? Sino nagluluto dyan? Yung ganun may merienda ba? As in, hindi siya amoy perfume. Amoy pagkain siya. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on to one of my favorite perfumes talaga. I have here, this is Twilight Woods. Nakita nyo to sa Instagram story ko. My God! This exactly smells like Ariana Grande's Cloud. Like, if you're on a budget looking for something that's similar to Cloud, girl, this is super dupe ng Cloud. And also, mga girls, ang dami nagtatanong sa akin na, why buy a dupe ng Cloud if Ariana Grande Cloud has a mist? You can, sure. Parang parehas lang naman yun eh. Pero, in terms of longevity, kasi may friend ako, meron siyang Cloud ni Ariana na mist. Hindi siya super duper long lasting compared to the perfume. But this one lasts long. This one is not bad. And it smells exactly like Ariana Grande's Cloud. Tapos, may friend ako, he's straight. Pinaamoy ko sa kanya kasi, you know, straight dudes sometimes hindi nila madistinguish yung perfume. Sabi ko, pinakita ko yung Ariana Grande perfume. Amoyin mo to. Tapos, pinamoy ko din to. Amoyin mo to. Gumunan ako. And then he was like, nung inamoyin niya, parang parehas lang naman. And girl, that's coming from a dude who doesn't know about perfumes, okay? So, if you're looking for a dupe ng Ariana Grande Cloud, Twilight Woods is a dupe ng Ariana Grande Cloud. Super ganda. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on. This is the last perfume I have. This is sa Bath & Body Works. I swear, this is the best one. This is Dahlia Bakla. Lotion Neto, pati perfume neto, napaka bango. For me, it smells like honeysuckle. 
Very sweet, very payami, pero hindi siya nakakahilo. Bango ang mysterious na amoy niya. Tapos, alam niyo yung technique ko dito. Maglalagay ako lotion nito, yung Dahlia. Tapos, papaliguan ko to sa sarili ko, girl. Girl, you don't need to retouch the whole day. You're gonna smell so fresh the whole day. Like, there's this one time, nag-shopping nga kami ng jowa ko. Like, alam niyo sa sobrang bango ko, girl. Yung tipo na padala ako sa fitting room, ma. Nakakaloka. I swear. Ito, I've been using this all the time. Hindi siya OA yung amoy niya. Basta, I got so much compliments nito. Even my friends are like, may bango mo. I swear. Dahlia, I totally get the hype nito. Gamit din ato to ni Jessie Mendiole. If I'm not mistaken. And I totally get it. It's so good. Ganda siya. Alright, mga girls. So that concludes this video of my perfume collection affordable edition. So ayan nga, mga girls. If you wanna smell masyike pero not spend na maluwag, this video is definitely for you, mga girls. And also, mga girls, like, comment down below what other affordable perfumes, whether it be Benz, Oxygen, Pen Shop, any brands, like, comment down below what other perfumes you want me to try. And also, pagdating sa mga designer perfumes, what other also designer perfumes you want me to try, what was your experience, or also, kung meron ka man neto, at least one dito, what was your experience of perfume na yan? I wanna know, like, comment down below. I find it so interesting talaga pagdating sa mga experiences nyo, especially pagdating sa perfumes, kasi I just believe that perfume is like love potions to me. You know what I mean? So, yeah. And of course, small curls, I hope you found this vlog interesting and helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And of course, small curls, very important is to stay machine cap. My mother. How's the cave? Bye, guys!